Welcome to Trapping Inc. Tech Tip. I'm Rich. Probably one of the more popular episodes we've, we've done was uh, we affectionately called Pizza Money. And it was about the, the ermine, the, the white weasel, and, and how we uh, prefer to catch them. And it really wasn't, I don't know so much about the weasel, but it was how we did it. We took an, and uh, used simply a rat trap and we, we built it inside a box, okay? So the, the great thing about that is that that box controls access. The weasel can only go in this way. He can't go in from the sides or anything else. He's gonna go in this way. We further modified our rat trap by putting on this pull. You see this, this uh, pull trigger here? So what happens is when you're set, this goes over top of, holds your spring in place, and you have your bait stabbed on this, the weasel pulls on it, Boom, I'll show you. It's really difficult trying to do stuff and, and, and just and show what you're doing at the same time because your big hands get in the way. Okay, so it's like that. We got our bait stuck on our, on our spike here. This is the inside here. There's only one way the weasel can get into it. He's got to go in like this, right? So he goes in there, he grabs a hold of the bait, and as he pulls, there he is, okay? It doesn't get any better than that for, for as far as targeting them and making sure that the strike's in the right place and the job is done. What? One thing that has, has uh, raised a lot of questions though is where did we get these? And I don't know whether the fellow that we bought these from has died or retired or, or what, but nobody can, I, I've sent people to where I got them and nobody can find them. So I'm gonna show you how to make some. They're really, really simple. This usually has that, that silly little uh, rocker pan on it that all um, uh, wooden mouse traps and rat traps come with that you smear the peanut butter on and they lick off and never get caught. So all you do is you pull that off and then, then uh, I'll show you how, how we build this and how we install it. I don't have any plastic, so I'm going to make it out of wood. But I got to make it so that the grain on my wood is not weak. Okay, so I want to I want to have my grain running in this direction here. I've got a, this is uh, some birch that I have left over from stuff that I cut uh, with the, the sawmill. Let's get at it. 